All right, good afternoon. <laughs> As you see, this money is busting out the envelope. It's time to stuff June. I'm ready. Money is ready. You ready? Let's get it. Good afternoon. It is budgeting time. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day. Cash is busting out the envelope, <laughs> ready to budget, and so am I. Hope everyone is doing well. Uh, today we are stuffing, stuffing four thousand sixty-five dollars. Let's turn this down. All right, four thousand sixty-five dollars is what we're stuffing today. We are gonna put. Uh, $1,010 in primary, $1,961 into bills. Annual payments are getting $133. Family annuals are get, is getting $141. Uh, Vision binder is getting $510. And other savings areas is getting $310. Um, I will eventually go through my spreadsheet and how it all works. Um, I love it. That it does all tie in together. Um, it tracks bills, um, bill count. Um, I did go in and prep the bill count that I needed. Um, so it tracks all the denominations that I needed. So when I got ready to go to the bank, I had all the denominations there. Um, as I brought money in, I was able to input those into the sheet and it just broke it all down for me. Um, let me know what I needed, um, bills that I had and what I needed to have <laughs> is all there. So. Again, I'm working on a series to actually go over my sheet a lot better. Um, if you're interested, you can put it down in the comments and that'll kind of expedite the process. Um, otherwise, we're going to stuff this cash. Um, we'll start by counting this cash. Again, we should be at uh, 4065 And let's go. Hope everyone is having a wonderful day today. I am. Um, the sun is out. I said I wanted to give some of this nice uh, sunshine, this light before um, it went down. Just a better video with this um, natural light opposed to using those ring lights for me. Um, so just wanted to use it. Hundreds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Seventeen hundred. Fifties, fifty-one, fifty-two, fifty-three, fifty-four, fifty-five, fifty-six, fifty-seven, fifty-eight, fifty-nine, fifty, nine, fifty, and twenties, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-one, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-two, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-three, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-four, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty-five. 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 80, 900, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 260, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 91, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 180, plus 180, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, plus 60, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, plus 15, 4,065. Perfect. Numbers are there. Denominations are all set. Um, again, my sheet has all my denominations on there. They're all counted down. Everything should be good to go. Um, at the end of the stuffing, this uh, tray should be empty and our binder should be stuffed all right let's get to it primary spending if you all know i just actually um 
put out my primary spending savings. Um, for me, my savings challenges um, look a little different from most the way that I try to save. Um, is mainly through my primary um, spending. So areas of not spending um, too much on groceries or gas um, or just regular daily spending. Um, so check out my uh, close of May if you want uh, more information on that. Uh, let's see, spending is getting 220s, 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82. I've been catching up on my videos this morning in between making my own video um, and everybody's getting their stuffing done. Uh, we still got a few days left in the month, but um, getting those videos out. That's awesome. Um, let's see. Groceries is getting 350. It's getting five. One, two, three, four, five. Fifties and five twenties. One, two, three, four, five. 51, 52, 20, 40, 60, 83, 150 for groceries. Gas money is getting 250. It's getting 450s. 1, 2, 3, and 4, 50s, 220s, 110. 51, 52, 20, 40, 50, 250 for gas for the week. My son is getting 50, two 20s, and a 10 for him. Household is getting $40, just two 20s. And fun money, we've got 40 rolling over, um, just in case we end up doing anything special for Memorial Day. Uh, fun money is getting 120s. One, two, three, four, five. 20, 40, 60, 81. 100 for fun money. Let's Have you stuffed? <laughs> have you stuffed uh, June yet? You can put down in the comments below. Have you stuffed June? Are you ready to stuff June? Looking forward to it. Um, June for me, I have an extra paycheck. I'm excited about that. Um, of course, it all goes to savings. Um, one thing that I've noticed since starting to budget is that I, I spend very little money, um, and I look forward to that extra check coming in just so I can put it in my binders, um, just so I can add to the savings challenges, um, just so I can uh, decrease some of those sinking funds or accomplish some of those sinking funds. So yeah, looking forward to that. Stash is getting an extra 20. And that was a rollover 20, so we've got 40 in stash. Just in case something comes up. Uh, giving we did not stuff on this one so this video is just going to be the primary um, spending I do always come back with another video to do um, the count of the binders and then also my sinking funds on that one is where I'll go ahead and do uh, my extra spending we'll go into giving as well um, that is it for the primary spending binder so if you noticed, I made an amateur mistake when I put these label on. I didn't clean the binder first, so it didn't stick very well. I'll update those eventually. Um, let's see. Monthly bills are next. And it is starting from scratch. We'll fill it in and empty it out next month. Cricket is getting... $10. Pandora is also getting $10. And Netflix is getting $16. 10 
I said a couple of videos ago that if I didn't watch Netflix, it was going. Uh, Y'all got to hold me to it. I have not watched Netflix yet, and I'm still paying this bill. Um, I'm not sure what the holdup is or what is pushing me not to just turn it off. Um, we just don't watch it. We don't watch it. I like the option. I think that's what it is. I like the option of having Netflix if I want it, but I also have Amazon. Um, I'm working on it. Y'all got to help me with that. Um, let's see. Phone. It's 10. Do you guys have any um, bills that you're paying? Any of those just monthly services or subscriptions um, that you're paying for and that you just don't use? Um, just curious to know if I'm the only one. Um, savings is getting 50. Car payment is getting 650. And I did just um, get a new, I guess, a I'm not sure what happened. They got a new system or something, but it's not paying. It's paying to a different company now. Um, so there's an extra hundred dollars in there that'll be rollover that I'll pay with uh, this payment. It was just extra that I tr planned to pay on top of last month's car note, um, but I just didn't. So it's there. Six fifty. One, two, six twenty-five. One, two, three, four, five, six hundred. Twenty and five. We'll make that full payment. Uh, this go around. For me, my last uh, big bills is my car payment and my student loan. So I owe just under ten thousand now on my car, and that's my last um, bill right now. Working on my house. Uh, credit cards gets twenty seven dollars. Twenty. What is it? 120, 15, and two ones. 27 for credit cards. And rent gets 10, 25, gets 1, 2, 3, 4, 500s, 250s. Gets a chunk of 20s. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And two 10s. And one 5. And this should be 10, 25. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000, 10, 25, 10, 25 for rent. And let's see, hair should be getting 50. Let's see if I get, maybe I'll get my hair done this month. Um, insurance is getting $138 total. Um, 100, 120, 110, and 8 ones. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Four hundred, total of 138. 100, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, and 38. And that is for multiple insurance policies. Uh, let's see. Black monthly, nothing this go around. It's annual payments, and this is where I think my budget differs from others. Um, so I go off the top and I fulfill pretty much all of my um, envelopes. I don't have any specific um, savings challenges at the moment. Um, what I do is I just save into all of my um, envelopes if you can see here and as we go through these like car registration isn't getting anything it's already set and um i believe august or september my car note is due or my car registration is due um, the money is here already so if i were doing a savings challenge it would technically be fulfilled money is here money's in the bank right now I'm earning some interest um, for my prime life insurance it is getting 46 20 40, 5, 6, 20, 45, 6, 
And this one is getting something because it I recently made a payment off of here, so it's not fulfilled. Um, my Providence Life Insurance is uh, fulfilled. Annual payments, <clears throat> excuse me. Annual payments is getting 32, 20, 30, 20, 30, 31, 32 for annual payments. And again, i come back in another video, update my trackers and count these. Feel free to come back. <laughs> uh, let's see. Amazon subscription is set for the year. Uh, my car insurance is set for this year and the first six months of next year. Uh, movie subscription is all paid for this year. My few one two three credit cards that have annual payments are paid for this year my google play is paid for this year i'm actually i think uh once it expires this year i'm not use, doing it anymore so i'll read uh fund this money later um blue save so because i fulfilled most of these and this is kind of what i do as far as my um savings challenge goes because I funded most of these areas and I do always um, kind of have in mind out of my uh, monthly income that I want to put money towards these areas. What I do now that they're mainly fulfilled is I just put a little extra in the back of here, my blue save, a little bit of extra. So one, I stay in the habit of um, saving this money. And two, um, say something comes up like um, I go ahead and... I pay my movie subscription. I can one continue to save back into it to add back up to the, I believe it's $120. So I can continue to save back up to the 120 or I can come straight out of my blue save and take 120 out of here, refill the sinking fund and keep saving. So it'll always keep me ahead. Um, now that I've gotten um, the month ahead and now just continue to save that money. So that's there. And also if I, something ever comes up, I need some extra money or an expense is just, you know, not accounted for or not adequately saved for. I have these areas, blue save to fulfill it. So blue save today is getting $55, 50 and a five for blue save. Just another savings opportunity. Uh, that wraps it up for that one family and same with this one these are all pretty much fulfilled uh, my son's birthday which is in december his um sinking fund is fulfilled my birthday is in january um sinking fund is fulfilled um vacation is actually fulfilled but just saving some extra because why not you may be able to have an even better summer vacation trip uh, $50 for vacation. Um, family is fulfilled. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I need to update my trackers because I believe we took $100 out of this one. 20, 46. Yep. Yeah, what am I counting? 20s. 1, 2, 3, 4. So once I update the trackers for this month, um, I will go ahead and start funding this one again to get it back to 500. Um, I had a call last week and we did take $100 out of here. So I will go ahead and start finding this one again, which actually what I can do, let me go through here first. Uh, Christmas is all set. Um, gifts is getting 25. And I mentioned my sibling's birthday is next month. All of my siblings are actually Gemini's and my dad as well. Um, all June Gemini's. Um, so now I just have my sister and brother. Their birthday is coming up next month. Um, so they will get likely some change out of here. Um, gifts is set. And then uh, mint save. So same deal. Mint save is getting $66. 50 60 So what I can do out of this mint save. So because I want to get my... Um, family binder back up to 500 what I could do is go in here and take a hundred out put it into family family will be saved and it'll come out of my mint save my extra savings um, binder here so that's just kind of I know again I've had some people mention just how my system's a little different uh, but my system it, it's made to, to match me and that's the great thing about this budgeting process you make a system that matches you that works for you this one works for me 
cool. Uh, my favorite binder, my home savings binder. And because we did have a lot of those um, sinking funds fulfilled, we're able to put more money into here this go around. Um, we're doing 400 for home. One, two, three, four hundred for home. Moving is fulfilled, so nothing in here. We're all set. Uh, my bedroom is getting twenty dollars. My son's bedroom is getting ten dollars. Got one random tracker in here. I actually went away, done it, did away with my paper trackers. I'll do all my tracking on my sheet now. Uh, furniture is getting twenty-five. Again, just one of one of my little courts from my budgeting. Uh, decoration is getting fifteen. Ten and a five. Fifteen. This is like the perfect time of day for the video. The light is perfect. I think <laughs> hopefully on the video it shows as well, but it looks uh, nice on my screen here. Uh, let's see, kitchen is getting 10. No money shifted, it was. There we go. <laughs> kitchen getting 10. Um, pantry is getting 10 as well. 10 for pantry. Uh, toiletries is down here. Toiletries for some reason is getting 20. I think we're going and we're trying to, um, this one needs the less, least amount right now. So adding a little extra to get this one fulfilled too. And then the overflow will go into the next um, sinking fund. Kind of like the, is it the snowball or the avalanche? One of those, I forget which is which, but where it is I pay this um, sinking fund off and then the money that I was putting into this when I go into the next one and then just keep going until it's just larger payments going into one area. All right, uh, vision binder is complete. And you're backwards, why is this not lining up? There we go. All right, what's next? Blue savings. Okay, personal savings is getting $50. If you're still with me, thank you very much. I appreciate you. I know we're not at the end yet, but if you are still here, uh, my f my emoji, and I guess I, it's one I use with my family all the time, and it's just that um, blue heart. So you can go ahead and drop a blue heart if you are still here. Just love for the for budgeting, for the We Budget fam, love for the We Budget crew. That's what we do. My son's savings is getting 15, 10, 15. And he had some rollover last month that went into here. Uh, clothes and shoes. I actually dropped this one down um, to just 15. Um, I'm in my mindset of saving. And the last thing we need to buy right now is clothes or shoes. Um, so I am putting some money up just in case something comes up. Um, it's summer. School is about to start again, so we'll have something in here. Um, but I am dropping that payment down, um, and I did up the house payment. So just kind of shifting those uh, savings spaces. Again, your budget. You do what you need to do. Adjust it when you need to adjust it. Make it make the most sense for what you're doing and how you're dealing in that moment. Uh, car maintenance is getting fifty dollars. Uh, I heard a little squeak in my tires, so I'll probably be needed not in my um, car, so I'll probably need to get um, brakes soon. Uh, student loan is getting one hundred and fifty dollars. We won't even talk about the student loan situation if they're gonna uh, give us any kind of break at all. I guess we'll see. Um, health is getting twenty dollars. Yep, we got a lonely little ten dollars there. Where is that from? There it is. Um, $10. Emergency fund isn't getting anything. This go around. Giveaways. All those get funded later. Uh, that $10 goes into uh, my binder and to the family, family day 2023. Extra 10 for there. 
And there it is. Nothing left. We've stuffed June. Tray is empty. $4,065 stuffed in the binders. Um, if you feel so inclined and want to see me recount that cash, do stop by and see the next video uh, where I go in, update my trackers, um, and see where we are. And it's kind of setting up to start um, my budget for July. One down, and I'm already ready to get July started. Uh, thank you all for stopping by. Thanks for sticking through this video. Um, hope you're having a wonderful weekend. If you haven't got your budget done for June, get to it. <laughs> Time's running out. Um, and it's good to have it out the way. One less thing on your plate. Have a wonderful day. To the We Budgets fam, the We Budgets crew, I appreciate you all. If this video has turned you into a part of that fam, that crew, welcome. I appreciate you. Uh, come again. Enjoy your day. Peace.